Did you get outside today? I really hope you did. We held off on the rain showers all day long, and we had temperatures like this, a high of 66 degrees in Lafayette today. Yeah, we're sitting about 20 degrees above average, but it's not going to last. Like all good things, they always come to an end, especially in the weather area here in the Midwest. That happens all the time. Rain cam right now, pretty quiet outside. Uh, for this time of the night, boy, it's mild. 53 degrees currently in Lafayette. We are still holding on to some light showers, some light sprinkles around the area. Not a very steady or heavy rain, and that's what's going to happen for the rest of this evening. We've got this system, very impressive looking system. Blizzard-like conditions out here into the Midwest, or farther to our west. Here locally, you know, this big band of rain kind of fizzled out once it got here. I, I think a lot of people say that's common. Once it gets into our neck of the woods, it kind of fizzles out, and you see that here on the local view of the radar. And we'll contend with these showers for the rest of this evening. Very spotty, light showers. Some sprinkles from time to time will stay with us through tomorrow morning. You see here on Futurecast Monday at 11 a.m., we will still hold on to overcast skies and spotty showers. Again, not very heavy rain. And with this system moving through right now, our temperatures are only going to fall for the rest of the evening and in the day tomorrow as well. So the 60s we had today are long gone. We're going to be into the 40s for much of the day tomorrow. 48 degrees. By the time you wake up, around 6 o'clock or so, that's when we'll be at 48. And then temperatures stay in the lower to middle 40s for the rest of the afternoon and evening hours as well. Now, total rainfall, we're not looking at a lot. A tenth of an inch of rain. Maybe a quarter of an inch of rain in some areas, but boy, that's about it for the rest of the overnight hours and tomorrow as well. Futurecast gets rid of this system Monday afternoon and evening. Again, spotty showers will start to fizzle out throughout the day. We'll stick with the cloud cover until about Tuesday morning. Notice Futurecast Tuesday morning. We start to get a little bit of a clearing trend. I think it'll be a partly cloudy day on Tuesday and into the afternoon and evening. A little more cloud cover uh, throughout Wednesday as well. Now overnight tonight, a very mild night. Again, 56 degrees overnight, but that occurs early where we are right now, 54. Temperatures are only going to fall from there, and that's going to be the trend for the day throughout tomorrow. The showers, the spotty sprinkles, those will stay with us as well. Winds out of the south, 10 to 15 miles per hour. There's the seven day forecast, 43 degrees on Tuesday, Wednesday, 39, 43 on Thursday. Next chance of rain comes in by next weekend. Yeah, back into the middle 50s we go. Saturday, 56, 44 on Sunday. Uh, not to be the bearer of bad news, just the meteorologist here, but it looks like after the seven-day forecast, uh, cooler than average returns. In fact, we may have highs in the 30s uh, for next work week. Jesse, it seems like you're often the bearer of bad news, actually. You know what, but I'm often the bearer of good news, too. In the and summer months, yes. Like, like today, right? Come on now. Yeah, today was really nice. I saw a lot of people out walking their dogs today. It nice was day to be outside. a very pleasant day to be out there. All right, Jesse, thank you. Well,